Hello everybody, my name is Kedem, welcome back for another video of Life is Strange. We're gonna continue this series, boys, obviously continuing right where we last left off. Let's uh, have a lot of fun today, boys, and uh, see what's gonna happen, really. Alright, so we're back where we started, boys, so that's where we last left off for Grio. Let's find out how to stop these guys, how to stop Typhon and everything. Uh, obviously my two friends just left because I just had a crisis right there. Let's read the map really quick. So uh, we've got Typhon Pit, all the mines, the old refinery and everything. All right, so that's that's that. I guess I can read it. There we go. That's pretty much that. We do have the flash drive. Let's uh, use Gates the laptop really quick. came in from the sat phone at 8.41 p.m. I should find the next call and see if that has any information. So we gotta find the next call after 8.41. So uh, which one would that be though? So that's 11.26, so 8.41, that's p.m. though, right? So uh, which one would that be? Would that be this one right there, ongoing or outgoing? It's, it is from Typhon, so what is this? Lena, it's Diane. We have a problem. You're kidding. There's a kid lost in the mountain near the pit. We need to postpone. Lena? Haven is your site, Diane, and therefore this is your decision. I know I don't need to remind you of the stakes. Someone could be hurt. Or killed. We've been over this. Anyone up there has disregarded posted notices and accepted full liability. We're talking about a child. I'm just asking for one day. If you postpone tonight's scheduled blast, you put Rhea in jeopardy. That puts the whole company in jeopardy. Is that what you want? No. Then do the math and make the right call. Email me when it's done. I will. So Typhon thought Rhea, whatever that is, was worth risking our lives. Let's hope Diane's email sheds more light. All right. Well, what about Rhea? So Diane called HQ to discuss something called Rhea. What is Rhea? So, well, well that's not what I meant to do. So we got to check the emails now concerning uh, Rhea, whatever that means. Not sure what that is. Uh, we've got to look maybe into the Seems emails. Seems like a lot is hanging on these inspections. So I wanted to congratulate you and your efforts in the Avon Springs inspection campaign. I just got word back to the state that we're officially passed inspection. Okay, interesting. Whatever passed Typhon inspection, huh? To, it looks like they've all but gotten away with it. Pretty much. Uh, we've got some sponsoring. Of course, that was Diane's idea. So she's sponsoring the festival and the home stretch. Make sure this expansion fails if it's the last thing I do. Yeah, all right. So we do have uh something. So tonight's opening. What this is, is this? The email Diane mentioned. So what is Rhea? All right. So I warned you, Lena. I fucking warned you. Rhea, Rhea went off. Went what is Rhea? Detected. A second blast went off that night. What did Lena say? Without the scheduled blast. Rhea will be discovered. Are these hiding something in the mountain, a mountain or something? They set off the blast that killed Gabe to cover up another one somewhere else. That's why they couldn't wait. If I can find out where that blast went off, it might tell me why it was so important. Okay, so Rhea was a, a second blast, I guess. So where was this second blast? I am not sure. So file browser. So now we got to look into the files. Uh, maybe a Rhea schematic. This is Rhea. Fuck. This map's too small to tell where this is. I need a map. Needs a map? Well, there it is. There's the map, boys. Let's That's search on the map. Pretty easy so far. Mine collapse. Why would they set off a blast in their current mine to cover up a blast in their... Old mine. Didn't Typhon just have inspections around the old site? They weren't mining for anything. They were burying something. The fuck would they be burying, boys? That's what I'm wondering right here. All right, that's it. Wait, what? That's the chapter. All right, well, I guess we just finished the chapter, boys. Alex chose Ryan to distract Diane. 
why is everybody choosing Steph? Whatever, I guess. Uh, Alex took Charlotte's anger from her. Okay. Uh, so I did. Uh, I am part of like a majority who did that. Alex made Diane angry. Uh, I guess most people wanted to make her sad. But how do you make her sad instead of angry? I'm not sure. Uh, Alex didn't play a record. Well, you know, 31% of the uh, players, I guess, are worried about copyrights. That's why they didn't do it. Alex did some we some weeding on the uh, rooftop. Okay. And uh, Eden and Alex were never knocked out in battle. Oh, would you look at that? 98%. Who is the 1% who actually was knocked out or got both of them knocked out? Who is that terrible? That 1% of people must be a really bad player or something, boys. Good lord. All right, let's go into the next chapter. We're entering chapter 4, Flicker, boys. Let's do this. I'm pretty sure there's going to be five chapters. Usually that's what Life is Strange is all about. There's like five chapters or something like that. Pike, so we're really coming up towards the end here. All the evidence you need to nail Typhon for Gabe's death and plenty more. All right. Bring it with you. I'll meet you in an hour. Thanks. Talk soon. Who the hell is Spike? Citizens of Haven Springs, we are live at the Scream Festival. One final reminder to head over to the Lace Flower Cart and grab a rose before they're gone. At Haven's inaugural Spring Festival, eligible women of good stock and birthing age would offer up roses in order to attract a mate. What can I say? History is weird. Thankfully, we've lost the mating stuff, but kept the roses. And if you do have a special someone in mind, a rose is a great way to say you care. And an even better way to say, hey, look, a rose. Sounds fun. Is giving away a rose something I'd do? Maybe. I can decide downstairs. With what money do you want me to take a rose? First off, well, I need to keep my money. I'm broke as it is. Broke enough as it is. Up with this all night. Instead this sounds like a apartment. perfect anime movie or something, boys. What the hell is that uh, thing? Teenagers only. Oh, okay, never mind then. Uh, let's look. Okay, so this is a Very video game, actually. Okay, it's a video game. Oh, we got some Chinese takeout. Why do I never clean up? Can I actually clean up this time? I'm thinking this will make an excellent after festival snack. See, it doesn't even let me clean up, so it better not be an option uh, or uh, an op uh, a thing at the end of the chapter telling me that I didn't clean up because. Uh, there is no option to do to do so. So I do have a message from uh, SMS. Stefan Ryan, what is this? Uh, Ryan, holy shit. All right, so uh, what is this right here? There was a second blast. Okay. Uh, Steph and I want to hear everything. And we're at the stage. Meet us when you're ready. Okay. And uh, we've got Eden. Uh, oh, that's the first page. All right, so no spoilers. But Taenor finds a gate to the underworld and fights the king of demons. All right, I'm uh, intrigued by the rest of it, I guess. He's literally spoiling me from his, uh, the whole story and everything. So we got a pressed rose. What is this? But not very Gabe. Why does he have this? Yeah, I don't know why he has that exactly. Someone must have given it to him, maybe Charlotte or something. So let's uh, find out really quick. We, gotta, um, we can open the chest if we want. Is there anything in the chest that uh, is for us that we can take right now? A robot, ornaments, or a string lights. I don't have anything. Now, nope. I'll grab the USB stick. USB stick. Okay, yeah, I do need to grab the USB stick. That's a good idea, actually. But where the hell is it? Well, I actually don't know where it is. Oh, well, boys. Uh, let's just go ahead. There is Gabe's note right here. There's the, there's the USB stick right there, boys. There okay. it is. Time to so head now we got steps. it. Got a message from Eleanor. Are you joining us this evening? Uh, evening? Yes, there's. Uh, this is one party I'm willing to be brave. Uh, we'll make it painless as possible. Okay. All right, let's 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 go ahead and get dressed really quick. I do need to be dressed probably. I do not like that. That, sound, that outfit sounds like she doesn't know what to wear. Like she's got a skirt and a t-shirt. Who the fuck wears that? That's the worst. That's about the worst um, costume ever or... Like outfit ever. What the hell? I guess I'm stuck with that though. So this is kind of even uglier, boys. This goes a little bit better. 
What about this? I mean, this is fine. And she does have with that, she does have the, um, the socks that goes with it, I guess. Yeah, this just looks, uh, looks ugly because she doesn't have the socks on. And, uh, what about this? Well, looks looks actually pretty good. It's just she doesn't have the socks on. I want something. Yeah, she, she needs to have the socks on or something because it look otherwise it just looks ugly with her naked um, like naked legs or something. I don't like it. Let me just grab this one. I, I all of the uh, options for the outfits are horrible, so it doesn't matter. The uh, let's really look at the letter. So Alex, don't worry about me. The drive down south with my dad always makes me feel better and we have a lot of plans for the sw uh, summer. Okay, that's a really nice letter. Let's go ahead and I'm not playing you again, mine hunt. We got the bar bard at. Alright, let's leave this place, boys. I think I'm good. So we're going towards some sort of festival. Let's find out what it's all about. I mean... They already, uh, we already got uh, the exposition for death, the death. festival itself. Check, check. I don't know how it's gonna look though. Check. Holy shit! You own a skirt? Yeah, it's pretty bad as well. Hey guys. Happy first spring fest. Thanks. I need to apologize to you guys. What happened in the apartment? Something really messed me up. Yeah, I got a nervous breakdown or something. I think it's from uh, hearing Gabe. Absolutely not. I think it's from helping Charlotte, uh, probably. These past few weeks, I thought I had a handle on my emotions. But after what happened with Charlotte... It's the same old story. I lose control, and I hurt the people I care about. I'm sorry. Yeah. Fuck that. If anyone needs to apologize, it's me. Ever since we've met, you've been there for me. And then when you're the one struggling, I bail. Not cool. I'm really sorry. You're forgiven, Steph. I owe you a trophy? Absolutely not. If you think I'm going to give her the trophy, think again. I want that, uh, I want that, uh, Ruxby battle, whatever. Fair and square. I'm never going to give that up. She needs to win it. Uh, I guess we're both sorry then. If we're both sorry, does that just cancel everything out? I think so. We're back to normal. Not to spoil the moment, but Typhon blew up their own mine. Why? They're trying to yet. dig something. Not but sure we what, need though. All the evidence we need to nail them for Gabe's death. I got a hold of Pike. He'll be here soon. Once he sees what's on that stick, it's over for Typhon. Hence the celebration. <laughs> I think we've all earned the right to enjoy ourselves a little tonight. The band's coming on soon. You'd better be front and center. I need uh, need help signing up. Uh, who's playing exactly? Nice. Who's playing? Local band. You'll love them. As long as they don't give me I any copyrighted music, trailer. I should be fine. Go be a normal person. For I a did while. shut out the music Can't anyway, so it doesn't promises. matter. I'm That's protected right. now, boys. Nobody, YouTube can't hurt me anymore. I've got the music uh, shut down entirely. Give away a rose. Steph and Ryan would definitely be on my list. Steph and Ryan, huh? Time to well, actually, you know what? If I would have wanted to give a rose, I'd probably give it to my boss, Jed. He's the one that's been uh, the most uh, helpful to me. Or maybe just being super cute and give it to Eden, you know? Just something like that. I... I but if I really need to uh, give a rose to somebody, otherwise I won't give a rose to anybody, really. Uh, Apple mob uh, mobbing? This looks like a bad time, boys. This looks like a get drunk real fast type of thing, situation. Oh, Let's find out really quick. Year. What is this? She's, um, she's blue, so is she, like, 
God. Sad? They just hope Riley is doing all right. So oh, she's no. sad for some reason. Honestly, what I'm getting pretty Riley? pushed. So what about, uh, okay, so new dialogue on lock. Yep. What about Jed right here, Zach? It's been a hell of a month. But this makes it all worthwhile. Jed all right, so he's happy. So See, Jed's always happy, man. It's That's why he, needs, he deserves a rose. He's always happy. Right? What about these like students? They're happy as well. This <laughs> is Super tiny. awesome. Favorite time so, of the year, by far. Like that? that kind of enthusiasm All righty then. Infectious. But I'm not going to sit Especially on the bonfire or anything. What is this? What's going on over there? Make sure that I'm not uh, missing on anything okay. right here. So, what about these guys? Thank you, Steph. Thanks for helping me find the fun again. Sounds like Ethan wasn't the only one inspired by the LARP today. All right, then. Maybe let me find out really quick if there's anybody else we're missing out. I don't see... Like, I don't see Mac and his girlfriend over here. I don't know where they're at, but uh, we gotta find out. Are they... Are like, are, are they gonna show up or anything? There's a miner right here. He's scared. Typhon is not normal. I made a mistake coming here. This get out while you can, dude. Yeah, may, uh, get out while you can, all right. Let me find out really quick. Uh, is there, like, anything? Can I actually... I think I can actually visit the town. I can nearly free Grand roam whatever I tomorrow? want. Diner buyer. He Three wants to speak to me. He's scared? Gotta pull my shit together for this grand opening. These people won't be so Just gracious forever. We might. All right, I gotta speak to him. Maybe uh, I'll take a coupon. Help him out. No coupons, my dear. Just tell me your name and I'll remember it. All right, Alex Chen. Alex Chen. Didn't we speak already tonight? No, no we didn't. Stupid, so stupid. Print some coupons. They said it's a small town. I'll remember. I said, oh hubris. You know, you could try posting on my block. Whoever comments gets the deal. Oh, well, that's a good idea. I mean, it's a Best simple idea. I don't know why you didn't think of that before. But well, there you go, boys. I guess I guess I helped you out. I helped somebody out right here. What about this guy right here, hanging out in the that's middle of the street? What the fuck's he doing? Might as well wander around. Is that bald guy social. over here again? One, two, three. I control me. Chill, chill. So it's too bad I can't unlock doors with my emotions. Yeah, I guess I can't really help him out with that one. He's locked himself out. Oh, there she is. There's Riley. What the fuck is she doing here? She's scared. She's packing. Here I am, just waiting at the bus stop, about to change my entire life. Oh, they're really leaving for real. What the fuck's going on here? Hey, Riley. Hi, Alex. What are you doing out here? Just out for a walk. You? My bus comes tonight, and I just couldn't bear saying goodbye to everyone. I get that. I'm really gonna miss this town. I'll miss my Nana most of all, of course. <laughs> At least Mac is here to help around the shop. We're gonna try the whole long distance thing, but don't hold your breath though. <laughs> I won't. <sighs> I hope Nana's okay. She's in good health, but sometimes I wonder if I should really be leaving her here alone. Eleanor is keeping her condition a secret, but I feel like Riley would want to know. What should I do? I feel like what's gonna happen is if I tell Riley about Eleanor, uh, Riley's gonna want to stay, and that's gonna prevent, that's gonna alter her future, and I don't really want to do that. Plus, Eleanor wants to keep it a secret. I'll honor Eleanor's wishes, and at the same time, I won't ruin Riley's plan for no reason. You know, Eleanor was gonna be fine. She has Mac over uh, to help her out, and she has me. I can help her out, so. There's no problems here. Keep Eleanor's confidence. Eleanor is so proud of you. All she wants is for you to follow your dreams. You're right. Of course. Good luck with everything. 
We're rooting for you. Yeah, I'm not gonna tell Riley about the whole uh, missing memories Thanks, thingy. Alex. Have a great time at the festival. You too, buddy. Well, not you too, because you're not gonna be part of it, but still. Looks like we're getting down to our last packets of rose. You haven't given one to your special someone yet. Now's your chance. Well, I'm not giving anything uh, to anybody. So, we uh, we basically have nothing else to do. I mean, we could get to the flower shop and get a rose, but why the hell would we do that for? I mean, there's no reason for me to do that. I, there's literally nobody I can give it to. <laughs> I mean, who would I give it to? She, She's saying that I would give it either to Ryan or Steph. That's what a normie would do. I wouldn't do that. If I had a rose, I was forced to do that I would like give it to maybe like I said earlier Eden maybe just be to be, uh, to be cute with it or maybe just give it to my boss Jed because he did help me out tremendously uh, with uh, giving me a job and an apartment you know so for almost free for a couple of days so you know he deserves it more than anybody else other than that I don't know who the fuck would uh, deserve it so uh, I don't know boys I guess uh We'll, we'll just not give it to anybody. There's the ice cream people thinking about leaving, huh? Where I hope you're not you're still not thinking about uh, getting rid you of your ice cream that. shop. I'll come in one day, boys. Don't get rid of your ice cream. All right, so we've got a fresh graffiti. We don't have anything going on. We've got the black beast. What the hell? I'm sure Jed's around the festival. Maybe I can say hi. Uh, maybe, I guess. Yeah, we, I guess we can talk to Jed. It's nice to see Jed so in his element. Wait, she just said maybe I can say hi to Jed, me. but he doesn't want to talk to me. Probably so what the hell? Wow, this is a beautiful model. Re anyway, really well made, boys. Really well made. Well, what about this guy? He's all alone. Two thirty-three. Jelly beating uh, counter. Let's find out really quick. What's the problem? <sighs> This the red one so was 234. Wait, why do I do this to myself? Damn it. Hmm. I'll speak to him real quick. I'll try to help him out as well. One. Hi. Oh, hey. Nice to see you. You're taking this jelly bean thing very seriously. Yeah, because the prize is a $100 gift card. Oh, really? My mom just got a promotion, so I thought I could take her out for a nice dinner. Which is really embarrassing, saying it out loud. Not, at Not all. embarrassing. That's sweet. Yeah, it is Maybe sweet. I can help. Oh, for real? Are you good at this? How many jelly beans do you think there are? Um. What? I don't know, man. I'm terrible at this as well. Uh, I'd say 300, though. 300 ish. Huh. Yeah, could be. Feels like something just changed in that lady by the jar. Maybe I should read her. How many does she have? 300? What a nitwit. Not even close. Wait, How it's 800? How the fuck? Maybe I... Hey, I've got another guess. Yeah? Yeah, it's gotta be... Uh, wait, not even far. Well, it's gotta be 700 then. I think it's closer to 700. Yeah. 700 feels right. But we have to get it exactly. How do we get it exactly? That makes no beat. sense. I should read her again. Oh, she's scared now. They're really close to 731. Who is this girl? Hell yeah. 731. Oh shit, my god. The answer is 731. Don't ask me how. I definitely did not how. cheat and read her mind. 731 jelly beans. That's... That's correct. Yes! That's right. Thanks so much for your help. You rule. Don't say anyone. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. All right, man. All right. He's got the, uh, the whole thing. Oh, there's the rose. I'm not giving it to anybody, boys. What is this? Uh, Haven spit the jelly bean con uh, guessing constant has handed. All right, uh, we got the drum uh, drum kit. Yeah. Hey, thanks, uh, man. This show 
rules. It's, uh, <laughs> it's something. Anyway, I'm Izzy. That's Steph. We're Drugstore Makeup from Seattle. We've got um, merch. Dude, count me in. I'm dying. All right, Dan. That's the former band she was part of. Uh, is that the who they is gonna be there? Oh shit! What are you making today? What type of uh, are you are you making food or what's going on here? Or are you just a DJ? I guess. Hey Steph. <laughs> yeah, no worries, no worries. I won't speak to you. All right. So uh, what about Eleanor right here? Hi, Eleanor. Good evening, dear. Uh, lo uh, lots of work, huh? The decorations really turned out beautifully. It must have been a huge amount of work. It's worth it. Uh, we uh, we drinking later, or I better go. Actually, I don't have anything I to tell her. Going. Oh, I talked to Riley earlier. I think she's doing okay. In case you were worried. I so appreciate that, Alex. Thank you. Hope she didn't uh, forget about the fact that she was leaving. So, all right. Like so, Ryan that's pretty much it. You too. I better head back. So, uh, Ryan's ready for me, whatever that means. Where the fuck is Ryan, though? I don't know where Ryan is, but uh, we're and about to find out. So drunk, he forgot he Black us. Lantern? Okay. What about... Uh, okay, so where's Ryan? I don't know where he is, boys, but uh, oh, there he, there he is. Uh, there's a message bitch. from Diane. So, hi, Alex. I wanted to wish you a wonderful first spring festival. Unfortunately, I have to work through, through, the, through it this year. But I really appreciated your our conversation earlier today. It was a great getting to you know you better. Thanks, Diane. The feeling is mutual. All right, we're playing the long game with her. All right, let's speak to uh, Ryan really quick. Hey. Oh, hey. Just in time. So, who's playing? Yours truly. Seriously? That's awesome. Well, wait. Who else? It's gotta be me or something. Who else is playing? I hate you both. I hate you all. Didn't want you to Why the fuck out. am I playing? I wouldn't wuss out. Absolutely would wuss out. I wouldn't wuss out. Who said anything about wussing out? Nobody. But only because we didn't give you the opportunity. This is going to be awesome. Trust me. Yeah, whatever. Here comes the copyrighted stuff, boys. Let's go. Um, we've never played together before, and... Uh... I guess free... Uh, anyway, all right. Let's just do this shit, I, I guess. Sucks. Yeah, sorry about that. Sorry in advance. Let's find out. Are we gonna literally play like? Is it like gonna be a, a, a guitar roll uh, thing, or is it gonna play it by herself? Yay! Great music, copyrighted. You guys can't hear it. Whatever. Just hear, man. Just imagine, boys, some regular music, like classical music or something. She starts singing, but just. Just imagine they're, they're just starting uh, doing some classical music and stuff would be funny as hell. Imagine like it's like Beethoven playing right now. That's the music right there. I don't know if the music is gonna, it's gonna be gone or not, not, but the cutscene sure is. So not sure what's gonna happen next though. We're done with that. I basically transitioned there because there was literally nothing for you guys. So. It's either just transitioning or it's just my sister literally playing uh, random music or whatever. Like uh, non-copyrighted, of, of course. We'll see what she puts on or what she does with it. This seems like Charlotte wants to talk to us. Hey, Charlotte.
How deep do you think? The lake, I mean. Well, it's deep. It's not deep enough for you to drown. I hope so. I, I felt horrible this afternoon. I didn't know if I could survive that feeling. But now... It's like when your leg falls asleep. And even though it's still attached, it's become something other than you. My whole life, I've always felt so deeply. But maybe this is better? I'm sorry, this might be good. Well, I'm sorry, I guess. Charlotte. Did I make I'm a mistake so right there, boys, getting rid of our emotions? Sorry, I probably but... did. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Mm. Me neither. Good to see you, Alex. Have fun at the festival. Don't do anything stupid, Charlotte. Charlotte, please. Last thing I need is for you to kill yourself because I I, I did something to you. So, uh, hey, can uh, can you meet me on the rooftop? I want to show you something. Definitely, I'll be there. Sounds like. All right, Ryan so it looks like uh, Ryan rooftop. wants to see me on the rooftop, uh, which is going to be what we're going to be doing in the next video. There is another message, my block. All right, so uh, I guess we're done here. I wonder what the music was, but uh, we'll never know, I guess. We can enter the Black Lantern, but I'm not going to do that. See you guys for the next video. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy this video. Keep it easy.